Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a little vlog of getting my house in order. If you don't know, we just moved into a new house. Please check out my house tour. Today I have two major things that I want to get done. Um, I have to go back to the old apartment and just clear out the rest of the garbage that we left there. And then I'm also going to start painting. So I'm going to start with this room that we're in right now, which is my living room. And the entire living room is this kind of really bright yellow and while it's super cheerful and fun um, I just think it's a little bit too much so we might keep just one yellow wall and the rest um, we're gonna paint gray so I'm gonna at least start on the painting this afternoon but the first thing is to go to the old apartment so yeah my husband has been awake since like 7 or 8 a.m. organizing the house and it's really starting to come together. All of the furniture is in here, so I'll be sure to give you like a house tour update of where things are at later on in the video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and keep on watching. Hey, so there is like a lot of garbage and stuff just around left in this apartment. So I'm going to throw out all of this stuff and then give the place a good vacuum. So I did my best. I ended up cutting my hand on a razor, um, so that made things a bit difficult, but... Oh, and also the vacuum didn't really work, so there is going to be a cleaning crew in here before someone moves in, so I'm sure it'll be fine. But anyway, this was our living room, where we had our like couch and TV and everything. And we had this really nice island, which my husband loved, and that's actually why we took this place, was because he loved this island. And the island had so much storage space, um, and we're still trying to figure out where to put all the stuff that we had in this island, in the new place. So here you can see the kitchen, which had really nice stainless steel appliances and lots of storage. So this was a really lovely kitchen. Um, and with the island, it was always enough space. That stuff I'm bringing down. Here was our bedroom. Um, and this was nice as well. Huge closet here. So this was actually my closet. The hall closet was my closet. And then my husband's closet was the one in the bedroom. So that was nice. Here is our little bathroom nice sink and the tub as well we're leaving the shower curtain because we don't need it and maybe the next people will want it and then out here is the huge balcony really spacious balcony out here um, and the bus stop was like right there to go to my old work so the location was good, the balcony was big. It's a really, really nice place for like a single bachelor or a young couple, which is what we were. But we just outgrew this place and we got dogs and it was time to move on. But we did live here for three whole years and I'm going to miss it. can't reach the ceiling so we are waiting for a ladder and in the meantime we just did the trim all around this area and the door so, yeah now I'm going to have a bath in my brand new bathtub yeah I'm just feeling really tired I didn't get as much done as I wanted to today but I'm gonna let myself relax anyway so here's an update. It's a bit of a mess, but we put the couch in here and we're keeping all the other furniture away until we finish painting the living room. 
This is all like garbage that needs to be taken out. The kitchen is a total mess. Bathroom, also a total mess. Put one bed in here, one bed in here, and we also have the setup that's gonna go in the living room. Hey, so it's getting late and I'm having a popsicle, a melon popsicle. And I've actually been reading the Bible on my phone. This is the first time I'm reading the Bible. I'm starting at Genesis in the Old Testament. I'm gonna try really hard to read through the entire thing. And this time around, like, there's something that's been making it super easy that I'd love to recommend. And it's this app called Read Scripture. And included are these like Bible project videos and they break it up into sections. I personally have ADHD, so the idea of reading through the Bible is always something that I've wanted to do, but just wasn't really practical for me. But this app has just made it so easy. And I'm all the way in Judges now. I started in Genesis. And it's just so surprising some of the stuff in the Bible that I just did had no idea was in there. So there's definitely some stuff that's like, whoa, like kind of terrible, but there's other stuff in there that's like really interesting. I highly recommend doing it. I mean, just as even a historical document, just seeing where like a lot of our modern day stuff comes from and as well, like out of a kind of faith area, like just seeing what's in the Bible and what you want to take out of it. So highly recommend this app called Read Scripture. And then on top of that, I've also been listening to a podcast that's called The Bible Recap. And then that summarizes chapters of the Bible as well. So I'll read the chapter on the Read Scripture app, watch that video, and then afterwards I'll listen to the podcast while I'm in the bath or something that will recap the chapter. So that way I feel like I'm really getting the most out of it and I'm really understanding from multiple perspectives what I'm supposed to be reading. Um, so yeah, that's what I've been doing lately. And this is probably where I'm gonna end the vlog. Thanks so much for watching. Hopefully I'll have more updates for you and I'll have a more productive day later in the week. Um, so yeah, please subscribe and I'll see you next time.